Could you buy a Cincinnati police gun? The I-Team did. We found it for sale on the Internet. This is it. We agreed to meet a complete stranger in a parking lot where he was selling it. The man on the left doesn't know he's selling a 9mm semi-automatic handgun to an investigative reporter. He never asked for my name or identification. So these guys are students of mine. Oh, cool. The teacher? Yeah. The teacher did ask one question. You're legal to own, no domestic, no selling anything like that? Well, yeah, I'm glad you asked. <laughs> these days you have no way of knowing in a private party sale, right? We're not identifying the seller because this gun deal between strangers in a parking lot in broad daylight with no no background check is perfectly legal in Ohio. Well, I'll take this one okay. then. It sounds like a deal. Uh, we said 400, right? $400 in cash and the gun is ours. But where did he get it? Where'd you pick these up? Uh, Smith, or, uh, Cincinnati recycled theirs. That's right. The gun used to belong to the Cincinnati Police Department. And we just bought a Smith & Wesson military and police 9mm handgun marked Cincinnati PD from a stranger on the street. And that's just the beginning of tonight's I-Team investigation. Tonight on 9 in Your Side at 11, how more than 1,000 Cincinnati police guns end up on the private market. And some, like this one, end up for sale on the street. All because of a deal made by the city and why it's all perfectly legal. Carol? Thanks.